Hey, what is going on guys? It's Such Speed here. Welcome back to another video. So before we get into the video, I have a few things that I really need to discuss with you guys. So the first thing is I actually have a new editor now. As you may know, yesterday I was talking about how I wanted to get a new editor and this is the first video they're kind of editing for me. So let me know if you guys like the style of editing that the editor is doing in this video down in the comments down below. That's the first thing. The second thing I quickly want to say in this video is as you guys may know, I've kind of spoke about this a few times, but I've got a project going on right now and another channel where I'm pretty much voice acting on this channel for a friend of mine and I would appreciate if you guys go show it some love and check it out I'll leave a link down below the third thing is, and this is the most important thing, that I'm actually doing something very different in today's video. Now, I'm not going to jump straight into it yet. I'm going to explain that in a moment. But it is something new, and it is obviously still Minecraft. But if you guys don't, you know, enjoy the content, then tomorrow there will be a PvP video going up as usual. So, yeah, don't worry. If you guys don't enjoy today's video, then make sure to come back for tomorrow for another video. <laughs> Alright guys, and before we get into this, I just want to quickly mention I have linked a full tutorial down below in the description. It's going to be quite close to the top to get to the point where I'm at right now if you guys do want to come on and play with me. Now, I haven't really revealed what we're going to be doing today because I've been wanting to keep it a little bit of a surprise. But as you can see by the icons, you might be able to guess, yes, today we're going to be trying out Pixelmon. But let's just jump straight into it. I used to be a huge Pokemon fan and I just want to quickly say off the bat, this video is sponsored by Complex Pixelmon which is the server. It's actually the biggest Pixelmon server that still, still is around. I remember when Pixelmon was very popular and if you guys can look at this skin you might know what account we're on. So as you can see we're playing on Pixelmon and uh, I'm on the account Pikachu. As you can see on the sidebar there is like three or no there's four different uh, colors you can connect to which pretty much stand for different worlds. We are going to be going ahead and playing on the red zone so I'm just going to go ahead and press red. So I have actually set up a Pokemon on red already. So as you guys can see we're already on the world and uh, I have already selected a starter Pokemon. Now I have a bunch of commands that I know I can use. They've actually hooked me up with a rank on the server if I put a dot in chat. As you can see I have YouTube rank. Now this isn't technically my account. However Noah doesn't play too much Minecraft anymore and he said I could use this account for this video and like seeing some of the people's reactions when I'm actually on the game or on the uh, server with the IGN Pikachu is quite funny. But anyway I have actually selected my first ever Pokemon. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you guys my first Pokemon. Pokemon. Oh, you can see on the side. Okay, I'm sorry. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and show you my Pokemon. So I actually have a Charmander. Now this is because it was probably the only Pokemon that I could that I really knew about or that I could see from the list that I could recognize, mainly because I haven't played Pokemon in a very long time. I have a lot of stuff that I don't understand right now. So as you can see here, I have Pokeballs. Um, I also have Rare Candy. Now I remember Potions and Rare Candy from the game very well. However, I have old running boots. I guess that gives me speed, huh? Yeah, I guess. So I got speed now. So as you can see here, my Pokemon is level 15, which is very... I don't know how good that is. I'm pretty sure I've seen po some Pokemons with a very high level. But anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and show you the whole spawn here. All right, guys. So now we're at the spawn. So I just quickly went to spawn. And this is what spawn looks like. It is a little bit laggy. But as you can see, I'm pretty sure... What Pokemon? It's called like a Go Ball. I actually don't know what this Pokemon's called, but there is indeed a lot of Pokemon these days. And honestly, my whole goal is to try and get the most OP Pokemon. I'm pretty sure I'm not actually sure what the most OP Pokemon is. I remember one of the admins telling me, but I really want to get Mewtwo. I don't know if you guys know who Mewtwo is. He's a pretty OP Pokemon, honestly. So anyway, guys, I do have access to a few commands. Now this is something I found really cool. So basically, on this server, I don't know this if this is for everyone, but I have the access to pretty much disguise myself as a Pokemon. Now, I was just kind of messing around with this right now, and it's actually pretty cool. So, if you guys know who Mewtwo is, it's uh, a little Mewtwo, but I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is just Mew, but for some reason, it displays Mewtwo. I, I'm, I, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is just Mew. Anyway, I'm gonna, you know, disguise as my big boy Charizard, because I am a dragon as well. So, yeah, I mean, Charizard's pretty cool, honestly. He's not that big. Like, Dragonite is actually bigger, I'm pretty sure. Now, if you guys don't play Pokemon or anything, that's completely fine. You know, this is something completely new to you guys. However, I'm sure a lot of people here probably have played Pokemon if you're watching this video. I do have access to a few kits. Now, I'm going to go for the most OP kit because I'm a kid and uh, I just love looking at kind of 
OP stuff. So let's have a look. So what do I actually get from this? So, oh, here we go. Ultra crate. Uh, okay, so I have crate keys. So I'm going to have to go over to the crate area and uh, check out a warp. So I'm going to do slash warps. And uh, I actually don't know where to use these crate keys. Okay, and I've actually found the area where you can pretty much, you know, use these keys, uh, crate keys. So anyway, I have an ultra crate key and a lunar crate key. So I'm going to go ahead and do the lunar one first because I want to save the best till last. So this is giving me Pokemon. Okay, so I want a Volcanion. Now, I don't even know what this Pokemon is. I'm pretty sure it's a newer generation Pokemon because I personally have never heard of it. But it's a level 70. Now, I'm not sure what the highest level is you can get on here. But I think a lunar crate key and a ultra crate key is pretty good. Let's go. Go ahead. All right. This I don't even know any of these Pokemon. Hold on. Okay. I want a shiny Zekrom. So I guess you can get regular and shiny Pokemon. Now I don't know if you can get every Pokemon shiny, but you can get some. So it appears I'm only getting level 70s. I don't know if that means it's maxed out. Okay. So someone in this chat just said the highest level is level 100, and they seem to know what they're talking about. So yeah. I mean, obviously I didn't get the highest one, but that's also fine. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and do another kit and uh, do slash kit Omega. There we go. And uh, I guess it gives me a random shiny crate key. Random shiny crate key. Okay, so this is going to give me a random shiny uh, Pokemon, I'm assuming. And uh, I guess it hasn't told me which one yet, but it's it's going to. Okay, so we did. We got Thunderous. Okay, I don't know how good Thunderous is. And I just fed my Charmander some candy. Now, or some rare candy, I should say. And <laughs> apparently it just evolved off of one go. So apparently it's now Charmeleon. And I can't get out of this uh, cinematic. So I'm trying to... Okay, okay, yeah. So now it's a Charmeleon. Okay, that's pretty cool. And if I give it another one, does that mean it's going to go to... Okay, it kind of makes like a... I kind of liked it when it was making the Charmander noise. I don't know if you guys can hear this, um, but I'm just replacing... Uh, okay, I really want a Charizard. Come on. Come on. Become a Charizard now. Now. Buddy's hungry. Buddy's eating all of the rare candies. Okay. All right, here we go. Charmeleon is evolving. Let's go. Now, I'm pretty sure it goes to Charizard. I don't think it goes to Dragonite. Because I don't believe... I believe Dragonite is like Charizard's cousin. Or I might, I might be completely... Yeah, there we go. All right, we've got a black Charizard. What? Wait, 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 wait. If you guys can see that, he is black. There's no way... Unless he's going to go red in a minute. But yeah, I... What? What? I do have a black Charizard. Okay, he's pretty big as well. The thing is, guys, I'm not like a noob at Pokemon. It's called like a Gobble. But when I played it on like my Nintendo DS, I wasn't really this into it. And obviously, it's kind of different. You know, I didn't invest too much time into it. The most fun I had on Pokemon was when I played on Pokemon Sapphire, Pokemon Ruby, and Pokemon Emerald. They were like my three favorites. I played all of those. So anyway, guys, I'm pretty sure I'm going to end my first video off there because we've done quite a lot in this video, honestly. Uh, but anyway, I just want to say a big thank you to everyone that's been watching this video so far. And if you did watch it to the end, I just want to say a big thank you. If you guys have watched it to, to the end, please comment down below right now what time it is for you in the day. Just comment that down below right now. I'm very interested to know. Please go ahead and leave a like. It really does help out. I just want to say a big thank you to everyone that gave this a go. And there will be a PvP video coming out tomorrow. So anyway, guys, thank you all for watching. I'll see you tomorrow and goodbye. Bye. Yeah.